guys welcome back for another great video so today it's about 10 anime like war trigger you must watch a charming school life and science fiction anime by the studio to animation if you are looking for an anime similar to this one this is the right video for you so for more details let's jump to the next part of the video but before we get started i appreciate if you first take a second subscribe to the channel and smash even that like button so without any further ado let's get started guys we have guys for number 10 nobunagan the story centers on the character of sheo agora while on a school trip to taiwan she finds herself caught up in attack of invaders against whom even the military is powerless it is then that she meets a mysterious being able to fight them her weapon a sort of a multi-blade arm containing the spirit of an important historical figure and she soon proves capable of wielding her own weapon in the form of an automatic cannon containing the spirit of a historical figure number nine a black bullet in the near future mankind has been ravaged by a viral parasite called gastria men have been exiled to a small territory living in despair and terror the story takes us into the daily life of satomi rentaro a young man with a special skills member of the civil security in tokyo this organization is specialized in the fight against gastria with his partner angel rentaro is assigned to the most dangerous missions but one day the two colleagues receive a mission classified top secret to prevent the destruction of tokyo for number eight we have god eater the story takes place into a post-apocalyptic universe where the population has been almost wiped out by powerful dominant creatures called origami to save the humanity pharmaceutical group has created an organic weapon the janky which draws its strength by devouring the origami these weapons have the particularity of merging with some humans and represent the only way to eliminate those monsters members of the Fenrir organization are followed through the various missions which fight the origami using the janky number seven we have kikaishi on the karasomori domain a college was built where the young kikaishi master of kikai a kind of force field friends from their childhood study this domain where lord kurosamori lived 400 years ago has the particularity of attracting entities and giving them new powers yoshimori and tokini are the descendants of the exorcist who was called a long time ago long to fight souls yoshimori's secret goal is to seal the kurosamori domain forever in order to avoid any further danger for number six we have seraph of the end vampire rain a deadly virus has wiped out adults in japan the children the only survivors of the epidemic were enslaved by the vampires who took the opportunity to make their come out in the underground of the vampiric city of the sanguinum yoshiro and mikaela hayakoya are two young slaves responsible for donating their blood to aristocrats who needs to relieve their thirst but yoshiro does not hear it that way and tries to escape with his adopted brother and their friends but the vampires catch up with them and slaughter all their friends mikaela sacrifices herself to allow yoshiro to escape from the vampiric city once outside the young boy discovers an intact word and understand that this epidemic story was perhaps just a lie to enslave the children he decides to join the resistance against the vampires to free the slaves and avenge the death of Mikaela. but what he will discover about the origin of the epidemic is likely to displease him for number five we have blue exorcist Wien is a boy who was adapted when he was still a baby by great exorcists one day satan appears to reveal to him that he is his father and to take him into his ward but it's impossible for Wien to forget everything his adoptive father told him until today face it with an investment opponent who has destroyed the only man to ever love him the young boy then chooses to fight alongside the exorcist even if it means releasing when he draws his father's sword the dominic power that lies dormant in him number four we have attack on titan a few hundred years ago mankind was on the verge of being exterminated by titans these beings are gigantic little intellectually evolved but above all greedy for human flesh small percentage of humanity has 
has survived by building walls higher than the titans, so peace has returned for a while. History takes us today into the life of a young Aaron and his sister Mikasa, powerless witnesses to the attack of a new titan higher than the city walls and the death of their mother devoured a life. From then on, Aaron vows to eliminate each titan from this world one by one. For number 3 we have Blood Blockade Battlefront. Three years ago, a rift between Earth and the world beyond opened in New York City. During that terrible night, New York was destroyed and rebuilt trapping New Yorkers and extra dimensional creatures in an impenetrable bubble. Renamed Hell Salem's Lot, the city is a paranormal melting pot where magic and madness live alongside the ordinary where every type of human vermin comes together to harness the supernatural. Someone threatens to break through the bubble and unleash the horrors of the new Hell Salem's Lot but Libra's mysterious super agent fight to prevent the unthinkable from happening. Number 2 Bleach Kurosaki Ichigo 15 years old student with orange hair who loves brawls like his father has the distinction of seeing ghosts as well as being able to touch them. This leads him to meet Kushiki Rikoya, a Shinigami god of death who fights a holo. The course of the fight leads Kushiki to give his power to Ichigo who then becomes himself a Shinigami. Now it's his turn to protect the town from the hollows. Finally for number 1, Gate. One day a portal named Gate opens to earth right in the center of Tokyo. This portal connecting two worlds leads to a bloody attack from the other world on earth. In this turmoil, we follow the otaku and the military at the same time named Yuji Itami. The latter abandons his agreement to come to the aid of a police officer and to carry out the evacuation of the survivors. After the army defeats the surprise attack from the other world, Yuji is rewarded for his bravery and heroism and is promoted to second lieutenant in the army. A few months later, the Japanese government decides to explore the parallel world to protect itself and anticipate a second attack. After passing the gate, we will follow Yuji's recognition unit who gets to know the inhabitants of this world and its troubles. So this is it for now guys, I hope you really enjoyed the video, if you wanna know more updates, check out the channel day by day. But anyway guys, thank you so much for supporting the channel and I wish you all a great day.